first single specimen to test this dating experiment is Jersey Shore's resident bachelor, Polly D. So my dating style in the past was always so surface because I'm on the road constantly touring. I'm in a different state pretty much every single day and the nightclub may not be the right place to find a real significant relationship. I'm at a point in my life right now I want more than that, I want the substance and I'm very proud to be a father now. I got my career on point, I want that one person to share that with. So this experiment may actually be the perfect thing for me. Polly revealed his ultimate celebrity crush. If you took my physical type and packaged it all up, it's Megan Fox. She got the light eyes, the tan skin, the dark hair, the smile, she's perfect. Then we scoured the country and found seven women down for a Megan Fox makeover for a chance to win Polly D's heart. Time to see if Polly D can use this unique way of dating to dig deeper now that he has exactly what he's dreamt of on the outside. Holy <laughs> clone. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> They say, um, be careful what you wish for. I only wished for one of you, and I have seven. <laughs> this is wild. Normally, when I walk into an MTV home, there's like a duck phone. There's no duck phone today. There's just seven Megan Foxes. They almost look like, they're just clones. <laughs> Will the real Megan Fox please stand up? <laughs> this is actually a dream come true. All right, sorry, take me a minute, but I'm worth the wait. No. My name is Christina Folk, and I am a mom. Who's cuter? Me or you? Me. I think I'm excited just to try something new. Um, obviously, what I've been doing so far isn't working, so if it means, you know, dressing up like a Megan Fox clone with six other girls, then you gotta do what you gotta do. Hi. Nice to meet you. I'm Lauren. Nice, nice to meet you. You can call me Lolo if that's Lolo. easier. All right. Whatever you prefer. He's a lot cuter in person. I'm Lexi. Holy D, nice, nice to, meet, to you. meet you. My name is Lexi. <laughs> I'm really excited to date Polly D. I think it's really important for me to date somebody that has his together just because I've dated pretty much every guy that hasn't. Do a toast to getting to know each other and hopefully finding the perfect match. Salud. Salud. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> like, how do you date seven Megan Foxes? Because they're all hot. I gotta get to know these girls on a people level. It is pretty wild seeing seven people dressed the same. I walked in, I was like, clones are here. <laughs> Yo, don't you get mad like when you're at the club and somebody has the same dress as you? Now you have six people with the same dress. Because I wear it better. Oh, oh. That's cute. <laughs> I'm Olivia Robles. I want a guy who's like charming and witty and can keep up with me because I go on dates and they act like it's like a work day and like flirt with me. Give me something. <laughs> yeah, and the hair. I've heard so much about it. Mm, yeah, it's kind of like my trademark. Right. Can it's I easy. touch it? You can touch it. Oh, it's really not moving. It doesn't move. Olivia broke the ice. She felt my hair. But that shows me she's not afraid to do anything in front of me. I'd like to get to know her a little bit more. So, I mean, tell me a little bit about you guys. I'm a substitute teacher. I recently graduated from law school, and I'm studying for the bar. Nice. So, I could sue you if you don't pick me. Yeah, or I could put you on retainer. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> That'd be better. I'm Sean. I'm from Las Vegas, Nevada. Come on down to the party today. I'm a little out there, a little goofy, a little inappropriate. So if he likes a girl that says <laughs> then I'm definitely not a girl for him. <laughs> I'm used to being the only girl with dark hair and light eyes. Like your I'm crew, so you're like, you stand out in your yeah, crew, but like, here you don't stand out. You know? Yeah, we don't stand out for what we look like. I'm Julia Scaparotti. I'm from Peabody, Massachusetts. I feel like the other ladies are dressed up to look like Megan Fox, but I naturally look like Megan Fox. I get called Megan Fox all the time, and I have a good personality too, so I think that will get me really far. <laughs> I mean, well, this is cool. I got to know you guys a little bit more, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Enjoy. All right. Nice to meet you. And his hair wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. I wanted to feel it, so it was like, how hard? How hard? That hard. How's it going so far for you guys? So far, so good. I have a twin Different. sister, so I've always had someone look like me my entire life, so this oh. is like nothing. She here? She <laughs> no, 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 no. No, she's not here. My name is Lauren Joffrey. I want to have kids one day, but I know the moment I have children, they're gonna f up my body, and I'm gonna have to get a mommy makeover. Whoever knocks me up is gonna have to pay for it, so better put that MTV money aside so you can get this what are you girls looking for in a guy, I guess you could say? I don't know, outgoing, mm -hmm. wants to have a good time, has goals in life. All right. You know, that's not a dog. <laughs> <laughs>
My name is Holly Kovacic. I'm from Vienna, Ohio. I do believe in love at first sight. What's the quickest way to my heart? Probably food, beer, and attention. What are you looking for in a woman besides dark hair and light eyes? I want somebody that's like kind, you know? Somebody that does nice things for other people. Somebody that's fun, sense of humor. For me, I only consider a real relationship with somebody that would meet my mother, you know? Right, you know, exactly. Mother, that, that I won't bring my... anyone around my parents unless I'm yeah. dating them for like a minimum six months. Holly's very family oriented, and I like that because I am too. So we'll see how that works out. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Hi. How you, you doing? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> you follow me on Instagram? No. no. Uh, <laughs> I do. I'm a big fan like of Jersey Shore. <laughs> I knew I'll put it out there. <laughs> so I'm from Massachusetts. I can tell by the accent. No. Yeah. Yeah. You have one already. Yeah. You can already tell. I was Miss Massachusetts, USA oh, okay. 2017. You would be Miss Boston <laughs> for your accent. <laughs> So what are your deal breakers? I hate when girls like when they're always on their phone, like when we're living in the moment. I like to enjoy the, the time like us right now. No phone, this is great. Right. So it's so cool for me to be out of the nightclub scene. Now I'm in an environment where I can actually get to know these girls. I turned 30 July 5th, so I'm getting there. July 5th is my birthday. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Well, cheers to that. Hell yeah. Wow. <laughs> That's funny. It's your cancer. Yeah. Yeah. What, what sign are you? Cancer. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like how I thought about it? <laughs> You're like, <laughs> where are you from? I live in Vegas right now. I live there too. So what side of town do you live Southern on? Southern Highlands, because I have a son yeah. and the schools were better for him. He just turned five. My daughter just turned five. Oh, nah. -uh. Mm -hmm. When? Uh, March 15th. Shut up, March 13th. Well, we're never going to forget those birthdays. Do you like animals? Yeah, no, of course. OK, wow. This is uh, a lot of work. <laughs> this is actually harder than I thought. They're all hot. They, may, they meet my physical criteria. So now I'm going to go a little bit deeper, a little bit further to find the right one. 